today in this lecture i will be starting with the task 1 of ielts for academic students the task 1 that i'm taking today is a line graph i am going to discuss the basics of line graph and in the next lecture video i will be taking a model answer to describe a line graph so if i talk about the line graph so it is this kind of graph we use basic terminologies for line graph we use this increase we call it as gradual increase we use this as a rapid increase this kind of line is representing a constant figure this type of line is depicting the rapid decrease here it is gradual decrease and this kind increase decrease and again increase we call it as fluctuation if i talk about the things that we use so we use noun in the and adjective the combination of noun with adjective so we have increase decrease plunge and soar the adjective form is dramatic drastic significant and slight if i put ly it will become significantly drastically slightly dramatically verbal forms are increased decreased if we want to write data of y axis we can write at with accounted as calibrated as calculated as now if i say i have to make a sentence for line graph for example here we are being given 1920 1940 and 1960 years are mentioned here percentage is mentioned on y axis and this is the consumption of sugar consumption of sugar in us uk and china you could say this figure is this this figure is this and here it is this this is the figure now if i have to write down line graph compares the percentage of sugar consumption in three countries in bracket you can write us uk and china in 1920 1940 and 1960 you can write the overall also overall comma the consumption of sugar you can write the figure as us uk china the consumption of sugar decreased in us and china but uk shows opposing trend so when you are talking about intro and overall in intro you are just paraphrasing the question along with the things which are being given on x axis and y axis in overall you are writing the trend increasing or decreasing or what is maximum if i talk about writing the body paragraph you can write down the body paragraph as to start with comma 
maximum the maximum sugar was because the data is of past consumed in us at 8% followed by uk at 4% and china had lowest consumption of sugar at only 2% so the very first thing is you are denoting the initial points after denoting the initial points you will be describing the trend you will be describing the trend as the consumption of sugar decreased in us and china from 8% to less than 4% from 1920 to 1960 in US and from 2% to less than 2% in China. Interestingly, the lowest consumption was observed in china so we have described this in body one similarly you can make body two of uk in following paragraph you can say On the other hand, 4% sugar was consumed by UK citizens. The graph increased gradually to around 6% in 1940 and then peaked at more than 8% in 1960. So this is how you can write down a body paragraph or the line graph in which first you are describing the initial points then you are describing the decreasing trend and last you can describe the increasing trend you can go vice versa also i hope you understood how you can define the line graph i will be posting few model answers in the description box and i will be giving you one assignment also to do thank you